Hi friends, I'm Dr. Jess. Let's go over the eight main root causes that you might have gut dysbiosis and bloating on a daily basis. Why am I bloated? Let's go over some root causes. Number one, sympathetic overdrive or being stuck in survival mode or flight or fight, which is the opposite of rest and digest where you can properly break down your food, absorb it and assimilate nutrients. In fact, the bile is secreted only when you're in parasympathetic mode. Number two, constipation or decreased peristalsis where things move forward. If they're not going to move forward, they're probably going to cause nausea, some acid reflux, some bloating, and maybe come up this way. Number three, bile stagnation. So if your bile stuck, stagnant, sludgy, forming stones, you're not going to be able to absorb fats very well. In fact, the bile acts as a detergent and breaks down your food into micelles so you can absorb the fats as well. If not, they come out in your stools and your stools float. Number four, food sensitivities or celiac disease, gluten sensitivity. Um, this is a big cause of bloating, a big cause of a lot of digestive issues for people. Um, so make sure you are keeping an elimination diary of your food. Number five, low stomach acid, low hydrochloric acid, and that's actually what's needed to disintegrate and break down your food into particles so you can absorb them um, and get good, healthy nutrition. Number six, SIBO, small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, CFO, small intestinal fungal overgrowth, parasites, or just general gut dysbiosis, all of these stealth pathogens, which are often there for a reason, but they do cause slow peristalsis, bloating, constipation, all kinds of other digestive issues. Number seven, sleep apnea or mouth breathing during the day actually helps you swallow air and causes bloating here. Um, look into having a healthy nasal and oral microbiome as that is the opening to the digestive tract and this helps you be able to um, breathe through the nose. Mouth taping at night can also help check a sleep study for sleep apnea. And finally, number eight, low nutrients um, or micronutrients like zinc, um, amino acids, which help to form hydrochloric acid. Um, this is really important, especially if you are eating the standard American diet. If you're bloated, here's some root causes. I hope this was helpful for Gut Health 101.